Okay, Virgo. This is going to be a general reading for you guys for this upcoming week. And I am going to start off with these um, Oracle message cards here. And uh, if you guys wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, I would really appreciate that. And, uh, if, at, and if you liked it, if you want to give it a like and a share, that would be cool. Okay, nature. As living begins, it is important not to let our busy lives obscure the wondrous presence of nature in the world and our connection to it. Interacting with nature daily is good for our physical and mental health. Even if living in a city, we should remember to appreciate nature when we can. The tree on the street, the bird in the sky, the first breath of fresh air in the morning. I am at one with nature. Today, I will appreciate nature at every opportunity. Okay. I'm going to use this tarot deck today. Okay, so for Virgo for this upcoming week. And if cards like that, you know, it's just from shuffling. But if they're meant to be, they will come back out. And uh, every sign has a power color. You probably know that if you watch my channel. And yours is brown. So far, we have water signs, earth signs, okay, so you have some major arcana cards here, which shows that there could be some changes going to you know that are going to take place here okay let me just look at the cards for a second like i said okay so water earth and fire signs here the signs that stand out the most though are let's see So it's a uh, Capricorn and Justice. Excuse, excuse me, <laughs> Capricorn and Libra. The Justice card is for Libra. Okay. I'm just looking at the cards for a minute here. Okay. You actually you have a couple tens here, and that's about harmony and completion and renewal. Okay, so you start off here with the sun. So it looks like you're a person that's like a happy person. Like there might be happiness and joy and success around you or with within you. It shows that all is well. And there might be some magical opportunities for you. Like going on right now. Next is the Nine of Cups. Okay. 
so looks like you might be having you know, some good fortune. If not, it looks like you're about to. Looks like this, there's going to be happiness and uh, good news. And this card, it, it it says that wishes come true. So looks like you'll be enjoying the rewards here. Or something. The first two cards are great. <laughs> And next is the Eight of Pentacles. And you, so it looks like you might be learning all you can about a subject, maybe even going back to school, but it um, looks like you're learning a new skill or profession and it's gonna be new opportunities. Like I mentioned, magical opportunities, new opportunities. They might be, like I said, presenting themselves right now or they're going to, they're about to. Next is Justice. And this is a stand up for what you believe. It's a, uh, yeah, like, uh, fairness and being reasonable and uh, if there's anything going on like you know something legal going on it just says that it will go in your favor anything like that that's going on it could be contracts also something you know any type of contracts like that it looks like it'll it'll go in your favor which you have a couple a card here that says good news so that's great Okay, next is the Six of Pentacles. Okay, so, so this can be a gift or a material gain that's unexpected. And this is also about, like you might be uh, sharing your wealth or your time with others. And this, this can also represent like profit or like an investment, excuse me, not profit or investment, but you could be getting like a pay raise or paying off a debt even, but then you have other cards here, looks like might have to do with work. So maybe we'll get that pay raise, but next is the devil <laughs> and this card it just shows you might be having some fear or worry or it this is about like choices and consequences and kind of like accepting responsibility for the choices you've made it's also about like temptations you know and it's also a card of addictions so addictions temptations it might even be like the illusion like you feel like like you're trapped I'm just looking at the other cards here. I don't know if you feel like you're trapped when it comes to work-wise, you know. Maybe there's things going on in work that you feel like you can't get out of or something. Next is the Three of Pentacles. And this card here is about uh, being recognized for your talents or your work. So it's, it's, you know, being paid well for your craft and looks like you'll have an excellent reputation. And if you don't, it looks like you will have an excellent reputation. I like this card. Okay. Next is the wheel.
So with this card, it's positive changes. So end of delays and you might get a lucky break. It's a fresh new start. Yeah, so it represents, you know, cycles and like turning turning of events and stuff. Next is Ten of Wands. So this shows that you could be working too hard or maybe too many hours. And you might be feeling overburdened and uh, under pressure, maybe. But this calls for balance. It says you need to find a little bit of balance here. Because sometimes, you know, if you work too hard or too much, it's it can cause stress that can, you know, and then that causes health issues. So just be careful not to work too hard or too many hours. Looks like you will be recognized for the work that you do though. But just try to find a little bit of balance there. And I'm gonna pull one more card I like to do um, at the end of the reading. And another Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. Okay. So this shows financial success. Looks like you'll have financial success. You'll have material security. And this is um, enjoying the fruits of your labors. So it looks like you've worked hard and it's going to pay off for you. You might even be happily self-employed here. But this can also indicate travel. All right, you guys. Um, if you like this reading, if you want to give it a like and a share, that would be cool. And um, if you wouldn't mind subscribing to my channel, I would really appreciate that. All right, you guys. Thanks a lot.